Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Well, today I'm going to talk about the boxing style of Riddick Boa, Big Daddy. Before that, subscribe to the channel, give your comments, like and share the video, okay? Well, I, I told in the last video about professional boxer Riddick Boa, Big Daddy, with a um, professional career with statistics almost perfect, almost perfect, because he, only one loss and one no contest. He won every boxing fight besides besides that that uh, that two fights. And well, he was never knocked out. So only one knockdown. He suffered only one knockdown in his career against Evander Holyfield, but only one loss and by, by decision, by points, against Evander Holyfield. Well, uh, there are a lot, a lot of professional boxers in history that had suffered knockouts, so they lost boxing fights by knockout. In examples, many, many examples, Mike Tyson, Mohamed Ali, Evander Holyfield, Joe Frazier, George Foreman, Larry Holmes, a lot, a lot, a lot of professional boxers. But Riddick Boa, well, you can say that he never suffered a, a knockout in his professional career, because it's true. Well, but let's go to the boxing style of Big Daddy. Well, uh, talking about a very complete boxer, because Riddick Boa could fight long distance and short distance. Left jab, his left jab, we are talking about, well, uh, uh, an orthodox style. So, his left jab was very, very strong. Of course, he, he wanted to, to keep distance from, from his opponent, and he used, uh, used many times the double jab. And his left hook. Of course, his left hook was his lead hook. I recorded a video. I recorded a video some some time ago about the lead hook. The lead hook. Of course, in this case, uh, an orthodox an orthodox boxer. So his left hook was very very strong. He knocked out some opponents with his left hook and his right uppercut. His right uppercut was also very strong and he used sometimes uh, two uppercuts in a row or three uppercuts in a row. And uh, we must talk about the combos, the sequences, the combinations of punches. And uh, Riddick Bowie used four. We used four combos many times. For example, his right hook and his right uppercut. This is one sequence. Other one is the right hook and the left hook. The double jab and the right hook. And his right uppercut and his left hook. So we are talking about four combos uh, with uh, three of uh, three combos of two punches and one of three punches. Very used by Riddick Boa. Uh, and uh, uh, of course we must talk about his, his uh, skill to absorb the impact of the punches of opponent, his opponents. So, he was very, very tough. 
a very tough guy uh, with with a, a lot a lot of durability so very very tough very tough guy and i can tell you that Riddick Bow um, well he wasn't worried about his defense so uh, for example to the movements to 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 avoid the movements to avoid the punches he, he, he didn't care about that uh, of course he, he used some blocks yeah he used some some blocks that that's true but he was never very worried about his defense because he knew he was very very tough so he can he could he could receive a, a lot of punches and uh, he, he, he didn't matter because well he was very tough and he knew it so we are talking about a very complete boxer uh, he could he could have been one of the greatest of all time that's a fact but well uh, it was a, we can say a, a, a short career because um it was 1989 until 1996, so seven years. Uh, and then, okay, more free fights in uh, 2004, 2005 and 2008, three more fights. But uh, it, it was just uh, because, well, he was broke, uh, many personal, personal issues, uh, uh, he, he, he was in jail, um, he... he he, he had bankruptcy, so he, he, he didn't have money. So f financial reasons, he came back. Uh, he came back. Of course, he, he wasn't the only one because I have another professional boxes that uh, happened the same thing. But he came back in two thousand and four. So eight years later, uh, after his uh, his retirement, his first retirement, uh, and that three more fights only. Uh, he, he never fought for, for the World Championship, the World Heavyweight Championship. And, well, he, he, he didn't care about his weight, so he, he was gaining gaining weight. Um, a, little, a little bit laziness, so laziness uh, in Riddick Bowie. Uh, and, well, uh, it was a good career, statistics almost perfect, that's true. But he could have been better than than it was. That's a fact. But technically, very, very good. Very good. A lot of potential in Riddick Boa. And, well, uh, a list of his punches. So, the left jab, the left hook, right uppercut, the combos, combos, Right hook, right uppercut, right hook, left hook, double jab, right hook, right uppercut, left hook. And very tough, very tough boxer. He has never been knocked out. Just one knockdown in his career and that's it. He won almost every professional boxing fight that he had in the ring. Well, and that's it. This is all for today. And see you next time.